the Zika Max, one of the newest cars, not only in the Tata Motors portfolio, but if you care to look at the Tata Motors portfolio, it is now packed with probably the youngest model line in the country amongst any car maker. Is that right, Mayank? Uh, thank you, Adil. I think that's absolutely right. I think this is not only a new for Tata Motors. Mm. This is a completely refreshed design, especially for the compact car. I think this is a cutter breaker. This is a design-defining moment for us and the Indian industry. You have what you call gone the whole hog because normally you have legacy engines in place. But this time even <clears throat> the drivetrains are completely new. Mm. So, And the very first manifestation mm. is in the Zika and they've come of a very high order. I think very right. See, we are on the course of transformation and as we speak, we are doing many things. Right. Uh, it was, of course, it was important. See, in this business, half majors don't work. Either no. you go whole hog or don't even Absolutely start. Absolutely right. So, we have gone whole hog and we are very confident. And we can go still further. We can go still further. This is just the beginning and we hmm. think uh, we have a long road ahead hmm. and we have uh, actually very strong strategy backing that road. When I talk across over there, your intrinsic strengths of diesel being paramount, but your petrol is really a class apart. How come this newfound love for petrol and the qualitative hike from the Zest to this car and still further? I think I'm very glad that you asked that question and you went into detail. So thanks to you for really understanding that. See, we, uh, I, it was wrong to say we love diesel or petrol. I think right thing to say is we love customers. And our strategy should mirror what customer is saying. And customer is saying very loudly that uh, both power trains will coexist in almost equal measures. So that's why we are betting big on this. Yes, power train, I think the new engine which we are showing uh, in the Zika is a category buster. Very great engine and heads off to our engineering screens for developing that. I don't think that there is, can be anyone finding fault with whether it's an engine made in India or in France or in Japan because it's there of that contemporary leisure. But you stuck a very important chord when you said you use the term customers. As I see it across over there, I've always maintained that Tata Motors makes great concepts, makes good products. The Zest and the Bolt are two clear uh, examples in front of us. Your legacy issues still haunt you in a certain way. And that legacy issue concerns more about your customer care and handling. How do you involve or attempt that social engineering so widely needed there? I think Adil, uh, you keep asking a smart question, very smart question. See, in this business, product is very important. Yeah. But the product is not everything. Absolutely. <clears throat> There's something like beyond product and before products. Mm. And that's where I think customer is uh, very critical. I think our dream and especially my particular dream is to make the Tata Motor the most customer centric company. <coughs> Customers should be at the core of our being. And now when I say it's not only words, we are putting a processes, systems, thinking completely behind to understand what she wants, what a customer wants. In fact, my vision is, uh, Adil, <coughs> research suggests that every customer who buys a car considers 2.6 cars. Let's say three cars. True. Very true. This is the data. And uh, my vision, a dream is that out of that 2.6 car, one of the cars should be Tata Motors. Great. After that, mm. if we are good, they will buy, otherwise not. Right? Yeah, so, sure. people ask me, what is your market share objective? I say, I don't have, my objective is to be in the 2.6 cars. Yeah, the, I still again uh, understand that it's great to be in the <coughs> reckoning among the short list from candidates, customers mm. who what you call. But, I'm talking about, at the end of the day, People in ERC, in your manufacturing, have done the cars, done everything, the design work has happened. How are you trying to tackle the core element of that person on the ground in the showroom? Because he can make or break what's a great product. I think brilliant thing. As I said, product is not everything. You have to do a lot of things. And so first thing starts with listening to customers. It's an art. It's, it's very easy offer, send, sure. but how do you really understand what? So if you, you would have seen in this product, a lot of feedback has gone. You would be surprised. In fact, around two weeks back, a big group of our designers from London and Turin visited India and mm -hmm. I insisted they should come to India. Right. They shouldn't come to for the review. They should go to cities like Sonipat, they should go to Ljubljana, the they should go back to of beyond. They Chennai. Should go, yeah, absolutely. And my thing was, Varying. you spend time in seeing how people consume cars. It's a very different, consuming car is a very absolutely. different. Absolutely, absolutely. Indians use space in a very different manner. True. 
even if a person and I in lighter vein, even if person goes to office, he has enough material in his car to survive for two days in the car. True. <laughs> so that's <laughs> absolutely. Yeah. That's so, it. The, so actually, I took so whole idea. So first thing is listening. Second is on the ground. What do you do? Exactly. How do you make sure your dealers are exactly. actually doing? Exactly. Yeah. So we are doing a lot of work in this direction. In, in fact, uh, first is dealer training. Dealer CEO training. How should he be future ready to take care of this? True. True. Dealer employees training. Are this you going to be ruthless as far as dealers are concerned? Because ruthless and capital and bold. Yeah. Okay. Because that's where it, no, they may mar you or make you. You know. I have instigated, started a system hmm. of uh, mystery shopping. You know, dealers have been told, and default in mystery shopping brings ruthless action. Okay. Because just saying is not okay. Absolutely. We have done everything, yeah, yeah, and unless yeah. you deliver. Absolutely. So we are apprised of this. I think what good sign uh, Adil is that first sign we got this time we have been rated the best ever so far in GDP. We have yeah, been rated third. third. I think uh, early victory. Climb. I'm not saying we are happy with third position, but we used to be among the last. So coming third is a good, and we are improving twice as fast as the industry. So early news, but let's see. Well, Zika they said came from the happy marriage of Zippy car, and if it really zips. I'm sure it will do the business for Tata Motors. It's early days, but in the Zika petrol as well as the diesel, there's a foundation laid for a spring for the company to go across and try and get back amongst the top three, not just amongst the consumers shortlist, but in the country itself.